France President Emmanuel Macron is in the Emirates on the first stop of a two-day visit to Gulf countries. Macron was greeted at the Leadership Pavilion at Dubai's Expo site for talks with Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, after which they are expected to announce a series of contracts and agreements. France announced multi-billion euro deals to sell Rafale jets and combat helicopters to the United Arab Emirates in order to replace its Mirage 2000 aircraft acquired in the late 1990s, aiming to boost military cooperation with its top ally in Gulf countries amid their shared concerns about Iran. The United Emirates is buying 80 upgraded fighter warplanes in a deal the French Defense Ministry said it's worth 16 billion euros and represents the largest ever French weapons contract for export. It has been also said that the two made another deal concerning 12 Airbus-built combat helicopters. France doesn't really have the huge capacities that other countries have in order to be the United Arab Emirates' main strategic ally. However, it is only aiming to fulfill the gap caused in its economy amid raising tensions between Algeria and its other strategic partners in the African continent. It's worth noting that French officials who told reporters that Macron will continue to push and support the efforts that contribute to the stability of the region from the Mediterranean to the Gulf. They also said Gulf tensions will be discussed, in particular the revived talks about Iran nuclear deal with world powers after President Donald Trump removed the US from the agreement. Gulf countries have long been concerned by Iran's nuclear ambitions and influence across the region particularly in Iraq, Syria and Lebanon.